very much. Uh, before we uh, go to Josh Hinkle, we need to say that the uh, uh, Associated Press has uh, declared that Lloyd Doggett has defeated Dr. Donna Campbell, an emergency room physician uh, from Columbus, with 52% uh, of the vote with about half the precincts reporting. We're going to have more on that race right now. All right. Josh Hinkle uh, is live for us in downtown Austin now. Josh? Showed up. He is up there talking right now, and he has actually got 52% of the vote over his Republican opponent, Donna Campbell. We also did talk to Donna Campbell tonight as she was beginning to understand that she was not going to win this race. Let's go to hear what she had to say now. Whether we win or lose, the mission does not change. Our passion is the same. And November the 3rd, we go forward. Whether it's in a re-election, whether it's for plans to how we're going to go to Washington, D.C. this coming year with solutions, or whether it's a strategy to continue on for next year. Right up there, you've got Lloyd Doggett speaking about his very possible win. Uh, those final numbers are coming in. Right now, some very, very excited Democrats here at the Driscoll Hotel, but we're still waiting to hear on some very crucial House district races. We've got 47 and District 48 still up in the air, very, very narrowly divided, so we will wait to get those final numbers in for you later on. For now, we're live at the Driscoll Hotel in downtown Austin. Josh Hinkle, KXAN, Austin News. Lloyd Doggett returning to Congress for a ninth term. He's 64 years old and was uh, first got his uh, start in politics at UT Austin when he became uh, UT student president in 1967. Way back in 67. Been around a long time. <laughs>